Okay, Resetters, on this video, we're gonna talk about why you should be drinking lemon water every single day. And more importantly, I wanna talk about why it's so beneficial to your fasting lifestyle. I haven't, I haven't brought you this before. I'm really excited to talk about what type of water, what we can do to our water, especially in a fasted state, to be able to improve our fasting results. And there's three reasons why you're gonna want to drink lemon water every day. Can't wait to share them with you. Also, I want you to know that this video is brought to you by Analemma. It is a really cool water wand that I'm gonna explain why it actually, when you wand your water, you actually become more hydrated. So I wanna show you that here in a moment because it's a really cool new hack that I just learned from my friends at Analemma. Okay. First reason, first reason you need to be drinking lemon water every single day. I know it's like so obvious, but I wanna explain why it's so important that we apply this first tool or this first reason to our life. And that's because water hydrates us. Now, I can tell you from clinical experience that what I've heard so many people tell me that they know they're supposed to drink water every day, they get that it hydrates them, but they just don't like the taste of water. And I have always found that very unusual because I think of water as just neutral. It's just water, I just drink it because I know I'm gonna stay hydrated. You need to stay hydrated, by the way, for your skin, you need to stay hydrated for your gut, your cells are demanding that you hydrate them and bring them water on a daily basis. So if you are finding it very difficult to drink water, what I have noticed is when you put lemon in your water, it perks the brain up and it becomes almost like a dopamine hit. The brain goes, oh, well, this isn't just water, this is lemon. And it has a different response in your brain that creates a dopamine pulse or a dopamine surge. Now, many of you have heard me say this before, that when we're looking at our health habits, we don't always need motivation, we need momentum. And I've seen this in people's fasting windows where they are like, oh, they're just dreading every hour that goes by, just waiting to get to that 17th hour or that 24 hour or one of the six fasts that I laid out for you all in Fast Like a Girl. And they're, they're just dragging themselves through that. Well, a little hack is when we put lemon in there, all of a sudden you take a sip and, the, and you get a dopamine hit and all of a sudden that's, your brain is excited and that creates momentum. And if you do it again an hour later, you're like, I, I've even had some of my patients put lemon water in a wine glass so that you're like, oh, I feel fancy, like I'm drinking lemon water and it feels like a treat even though I'm in a fasted window. So I love it for tricking the brain into being excited to drink water and keeping that momentum during a fast. Now, the other reason, one of the things I wanna to bring to you about analemma, why I'm talking about this wand, is this wand will bring your water back into coherency, which makes it so that the water makes you more, gets into the cell more effortlessly and gives you more hydration. Super cool product. I use this all the time when I travel. I was in New York recently and I only had tap water to, to drink from. I wanted to stay hydrated. So I used the wand to make sure that even tap water from New York City would hydrate me and not toxify me. So, and it comes in some really cool cases. So just love, love the Analemma product. So you can try adding that in as well. Check the, the notes for discounts that they're gonna give all of you. Okay, I gotta interrupt this video because I have a free guide for you so you can master fasting. It's called A Beginner's Guide to a Fasting Lifestyle. And all you've gotta do is click here and you can jump right in. Okay, number two. Water, lemon water specifically, repairs the skin. Okay, now there was a 2016 study that was published in Science Direct. And it talked about when we add lemon to our water, it does several things that are important for the skin. So the first is it increases collagen production. Like, think about that. Where are my menopausal women out there? How much are we fighting for extra collagen? Where you know, that wrinkles that's, that's showing up, that's because you're losing collagen as you lose estrogen. 
And so in order to increase collagen, we got to pull in as many hacks as possible. And this study in Science Direct showed that it improved co skin collagen production when you drink a daily glass of lemon water. And I'll leave that study in the notes so you all have it. Second thing that this study showed is it improved glutathione. Now, remember, when you are drinking lemon water, what's happening is it's going into the cell and it's powering up your mitochondria. Your mitochondria make glutathione, and glutathione is the master antioxidant that pushes toxins out of the cell. So think about one little habit of just drinking water and adding lemon to it is powering these mitochondria up so that you can detox your cells more efficiently. And then the third thing that this study said was that they're finding that it improves antioxidant production. Again, what we're looking at, the adding of the lemon to the water as being this cellular uh, win so that everything in the cell works better, including improving your antioxidant production. Now, I wanna talk about how you would apply that when you've maybe overdone it. Like, let's say, you know, you, had a, you went on vacation, you ate a bunch of toxic food. Well, okay, you come home, could we start to add in more lemon water so that we can improve the detoxification pathways of your cells and upregulate antioxidants? Okay, the other thing is what about, you know, if we get a sunburn or we've been out in the sun too much? Have we ever thought the next day to drink more lemon water but knowing that it's going to upregulate collagen production? We can use that outside of just the menopausal situation. So it's so fascinating to me how we have allowed our healthcare choices to be more complicated. We think the more complicated they are, the better they are for our body. But we never, we forget that some of the most simple things have the greatest benefit for us and adding lemon to our water is one of those things. So super cool hack there. Okay. Third tip, the third reason why you want to do this is because lemon citrus fruit, uh, fruits in general are high polyphenol foods. And as I have taught you in Fast Like a Girl, the polyphenol foods are massively important for repairing the gut. So let's take this to your fasting window. Let's say you're in a fast and your, the, your brilliant intelligence is getting rid of all the bad bacteria. It wants to get it out of your system, the good bacteria that want to make you serotonin, want to improve your immune, your overall immune system, want to improve your, your melatonin production so you can sleep better, all the wonders that are going on in your gut. As the bad is going away, the good little guys are like looking around and they're like, okay, the bully's gone, but I need to become stronger. How can I become stronger? Because I have a brief min moment where the bully bacteria are out of my gut. And so one of the ways that you can strengthen your good bacteria to make you all the wonderful neurochemicals to keep you healthy and happy is to give your bacteria, these good bacteria, more polyphenol foods. And citrus foods are one of those polyphenols. But the challenge we have in our fasting window is how do we do that? How, how can we do that when without spiking our blood sugar? We don't really have a lot of tools for the fasting window to be able to grow those good, except lemon water. So if we are adding lemon to our water in our fasting window, we are powering up those good bacteria while we are also destroying the bully bacteria and getting them out of your system. It's such a simple hack. And there's a really cool article that I will put uh, in the notes as well, another study that showed not only does the polyphenol count of lemon water help us, but if we have lemon water early, first thing in the morning, it's the first thing that goes on your stomach, that is the most absorbable time for your microbiome and your gut. So you really are giving these good bacteria added nutrients so that they can become strong and support you throughout your whole day. If you love that video and you wanna dive into more of the information I have on this channel, go to this video. Five foods that will sabotage weight loss. And they're gonna surprise you. These are ones that you're probably doing thinking they're helping you lose weight.